What's up, TBM? What's good, man. You doing the same? Good? Yeah, man. Everything works. Bless it, bless it, bless it. It's the first time I'm here in this hotspot studio. Mm -hmm. Looks very good. It looks very um, professional. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But um, I'm going to get right into it. We just came from the music video shoot. I see you already changed your garbs. For sure, for sure. You're already even <laughs> fresher than you was on the video shoot. You got to, you got to, you know. But um, so let's, let's get right into it for the masses of the Virgin Islands. Right, for sure. Who are you? Hi, my name is Tony TBL Bon Jovi. Okay. Yes, I am um, what you call a multi-talented guy. I, I, I kind of dabble in everything. I'm a producer, I'm an engineer, I rap, I do graphic design, I used to be a dancer, choreographer. Um, I, try, I try to micromanage a lot of different stuff, you know? Okay. Yeah. Okay. How long you been doing this, what, what you're doing uh, in terms of productions? And I heard you said artist, graphic designer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How long have you been doing all this stuff? Man, to be honest with you, like, my last name is Bon Jovi. I didn't even know what that meant, you know, until like I got older, but it's been in my genetic code since I was born. But I've been I've been dabbling in the arts since, like, I can't even remember, man. I used to be in art school. The music thing is more recent, but it's just been like a palette. This, as, I, as I've been getting older from since, like, back in, like, primary school days, it's just been me, like, dabbling in different forms of the arts, you know, and it just so happens that my interest more recently has been in the music, you know what I mean? Yeah. You hear that, folks? Bon Jovi. I hope y'all got what that means, okay? You know that the rock band, you know John Bon Jovi? Yeah, this is this is that blood. But I don't get I don't get the support from the Bon Jovi, though. This, this is just, I'm a, this is me on my own, though. Like, there's no ties, man. It's just, it's just the last name. There's relation, but there's no ties, you know what I mean? You hear that? Yeah. There's relations, but no ties. No ties, no ties. So guess what? It's Still gonna blow. Yeah, TBL, TBL. TBL. Yeah. All right. Um. So you got this project VI. Project VI. Yeah. Um. Album coming out, and um. You know, the streets is buzzing about it. Mm -hmm. you got the music video. You got um. You got some a, a whole. You know, plethora of yeah. artists yeah. on it. Yeah, yeah. It looks like a school bus of artists. For sure. Are, are listening to what you do. Mm -hmm. You know, helping you on this project. Give the masses of people an understanding of what Our Project VI is. Exactly. All right, Project VI man is pretty much. Like it's my solo album. It's not. It's not my solo album. My bad. It's my debut album. It's actually um. It's, it's not my solo album. Like I said, it's, it's my production. It's me. Pretty much. I started it as a as an album for a solo artist. And what happened is that out of frustration and trying to find studios and trying to find people to record us and mix, like me and uh, myself and a friend of mine named Naive, we was like, you know, let's open our own studio. So we, we finally did. And what happened is that I found it was a venue to get like all of these artists in one spot. So what happened is I, 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 I kind of changed the project from being this one guy's project to just being like this entourage of people on one production. So all the beats are mine, all the engineering is mine. I'm kind of doing like the Timberland Swiss beats, like DJ kind of thing. I'm, I'm tagging the beats with a verse or a hook, but I'm not, it's not my track featuring them, it's like them featuring me. And it's just pretty much everybody who's anybody, all the up and coming talent from the BI, who's gonna be anybody in the next five years, they're on this, you know, we got, Vivian Drastic, K Victoria, Jugger, Titan, Payback. Um, we got some surprises too. We got um, Emmanuel, School Manual from that Pink and the Deuces. We got, we got, we got a little bit of everything on there. We got a bunch of different genres. It's all my beats, like I said. So it's like the culture, the voice came true. But what we would do is we would like we get an idea for a song, and we would just sit down with an artist and play the beat, and we just create a concept. You know? That's dope. Yeah, that's dope. Um, I hope y'all are realizing what he's doing. He's Doing shock value, folks. <laughs> Here in the Virgin Islands. Shock value on steroids, you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. That's dope. Um, so I guess you got you did a video for tripping up. Yeah. Um, with with your man Dread. Yeah. I'm loving the video. You guys got a whole jib. I ain't seen nobody do the jib <laughs> to do a music video. Yeah, we went in there. And um and um I got it up on the site. Go check it out. Tripping up on 3 pmcom You know, click on it, click on it, click on it, give it as much hits because what you people don't know. Is that we're about to do our, um, you know, top ten VI songs on the radio soon. But um, yeah, so make sure his joints get gets up on there. But um, yeah, tell us about tripping up T because the thing I like about tripping up is you're talking about a relationship thing. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm a lover. I know he's a lover, and so yeah. I see the concept. Yeah, it's an inspiration. Tripping up is a debut single. It's, we kind of chose it because. Like we had a lot of fun with the track. The concept of the track pretty much stems from like the approach. It's more it's more the approach to a female 
Like, you know, you can have all the confidence in the world when you're talking to your friends about talking about girl, but then when you actually talk to her, you find yourself like stuttering or stumbling. And it's just a cool concept because it's real with metaphors throughout the entire song. So it's like, some of the metaphors have a metaphor underneath it. So it's like, like some of the lines even refer to other lines. And it's, it's just a cool song. It's like, it's something you could kick back to and, and relax to. And it's like, the reason I chose that as my debut single for the project is because like, there's a lot of dance songs and pop songs and stuff you can play in a club, but there's not many songs that you could just put your headphones on and vibe to. And I like this one. And everybody, everybody liked this one for some reason. So we just like, you know what, that's one with it. It's not necessarily a calypso or a dance song. It's not necessarily like a St. Thomas VI song, but it's VI artists doing the music that we love to do. So I think that everybody's gonna have a good response to it, especially with the video coming out. Yeah. And also, now that we mention a video, Project VI is not just an album. It's a 30 minute film documentary too. So like from the year, we, we, we've been pretty much working for a year and a half. So from, from day one almost, we've been videotaping with different cameras and just getting behind the scenes footage, all the drama, all the arguments, all the, well I don't think this sounds good, all of the boots, all the creativity, it's all exploding on video. We got a 30 minute film documentary that's gonna be upcoming, the 16 track album. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. crazy, yeah, yeah. See, we are into the wall. Yeah, we're raising the bar. Just like 3.40 p.m. is raising the bar for the website. We trying to raise the bar for that that sound. We don't want to be local artists anymore. We want to be VI artists. We want to be VI. We want to be a product. You know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. 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 I appreciate you know giving us a shout out. Cause y'all yeah. definitely trying to think. Yeah. Um, a, a major thing that I noticed um, or, or that I heard. I came in here. Um, not came in here, but I came to my friend's studio, WMB studio, mm -hmm. and um, he played this Kid Victoria track that I think is on your your your. your, your, your Project, okay, yeah. okay. I heard it, mm -hmm. and I swear to God, like, I want it. And I think the rest of the people out here, once you hear it, you'll want it too. It's, uh, a, it's a girl tune, it's a penny dropper tune. Neo Soul, Neo Soul. Soul. Yeah. What the hell are you doing with these beats? Like, Man. How, 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 did you, how did you harness your craft and make it beats? Well, to be completely honest with you, man, like, it kind of started, like I used, like I said, I used to dance, and I performed for actually some major artists already, but like what happened is that I would be the one tweaking the sound, I would be the one doing the mixes for our dances, like this is like back in 2000, 2003, you know what I mean? Like, I would be the one doing the mixes, so what happened is that like, I was a little familiar with audio because of that, so what happened is like, there's like a different program, like I use Reason, so I use Reason and Pro Tools, so it's like, when I jumped in, I didn't know what was going on. I mean, I had the concept of music from playing and rising stars, you know, yeah, yeah. steel piano stuff, but I'm not a pianist, you know, so it's like, I kind of like go in and I just like sit down and I'm like, you know, I, mean, I have an idea in my head, I just, I just tinker with it until I get it. And then after that, you know, we just run with the track, I get culture, I get one of the writers, or I write something, or the artist writes it, and we just concept. And the song that you're talking about, like, believe it or not, Kimmy, she was like, you know, this is not her element, but it was like, you have to be in it, because like, we know you're gonna kill it. Cause she, she's a beast, like, you know what I mean? All, all the artists that, that are representing themselves on this project, they are beast in their own merit, you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so we gotta wrap up this interview. Sure. Because, um, you know, my stomach pains are something. <laughs> but, um, how do people get in contact with you? How do they find you? What's your Twitter? What's your Facebook? Right. What's, um, you know, what's your phone number for the ladies? Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I keep the phone number on the rap studio. People call and ask him for studio time for free. Bang, just play, just play. Yeah. Put that out there. But, hey, uh, the local you artists. Gotta, you gotta support. A lot of support. Without the support, we can't do this. You know? Even but if you give us five dollars. Yeah, everything comes. Support. But um, ultimately, man, you can hit me up on the Facebook. It's Tony TBL Bon Jovi. You can hit me up on the MySpace, myspace.com slash um, TBL Productions. Or you can do Tony Bon Jovi. Twitter is at TBL Productions. My personal Twitter is at Tony Bon Jovi. There's projectvi.wordpress.com You can check out the 3.4 p.m. website It's gonna have a bunch of stuff up there I'm gonna make Project Vi 3.4 almost 3.4 exclusive So like, you're gonna be the first to get anything Project Vi For sure um, Other than that man, you can hit my email up At the studio, it's the hotspot studio at yahoo.com there's tlabeat at yahoo.com, that's t-l-a-b-e-t -E at yahoo.com And pretty much anything you want to get in contact with me for, you can get in contact with me definitely with Facebook, definitely with MySpace I check them frequently, I'm always on there, check the truth for OPM frequently um, Pretty much that's it, like, other than that, like sponsors, if you want to put your name on this project and you want to support uh, a mass of VI talent in terms of film, audio, music, everything, you're supporting more than just just a few, you're supporting many, and it's like it's all positive music, it's all positive concepts. Just hit me up 340 998 That's my personal cell phone. 
Definitely, man. Let's keep the movement. Let's keep, let's keep the ball rolling, you know? Yeah, like, now, um, you know, I always ask every artist that I, that I, that I get in an interview situation to one, give me a drop, and then two, speak to the speak to the up and coming speak to people who don't have studios right. and people who are trying to do this what's what give them some type of inspiration to know how to move forward and then give me that crazy <laughs> for opm all right for sure for sure um the only thing i could really say man based on my personal experience because i don't like to talk about what i know is if you have something you want to do pretty much focus on it and it's not just the generic me saying you can do anything because you really can you, you really have to work for what you want like nothing that is worth it will be easy. You have to put in that work and you have to be dedicated. Like I have a day job. I have a lot of other personal requirements that I have to fulfill and I still have to do this because this is what I want to do. So it's like, you have to be dedicated and you have to be focused. Everything that you want to do in life, you have to be focused and you have to dedicate. And once you really do that, like seriously, not just talk about it, you'll accomplish it. Even if it's not right now, you'll accomplish it. And you'll be proud of your accomplishment. You know, and I know you know about that too, for sure. Yeah, you know what I mean? And you know everybody, you got you, you gotta check out 34 p.m. is is gonna be the hottest, probably probably the hottest blog site, website, any kind of site from the VI. Ian knows what he's doing. You know what I mean? Just check it out. It's gonna be. It's, it's not it's not just a site for Virgin Islands. It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a site for everyone. It's a site for anybody who wanna see anything 340. You come to 34 p.m. and you check it out. Anything Project VI, you come to 34 p.m. and you check it out. TBL Productions, anything. Anything TBL Productions, check out 34 p.m. It's gonna be up there. You're gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna be like, have it first, see it first, know it first. 34 p.m. You gotta check it out. All right, so folks, like I said again, this is Ian. 3:40 p.m. This is uh, his head chilling with Mr. TBL, Tony Bon Jovi in the hot spot. Shout um, out 3:40 p.m.com. Don't forget. Yeah. So give your shout outs real quick. To For sure, man. I want to send a shout out to everyone who's been a part of this project and who's gonna be a part of it. I'm gonna send a shout out to Naeem Mason, Anime Entertainment, um, Kisa Richardson, Culture the Voice is a big part of the project. Black Hustle ENT, Kevin Donovan, Dial Brooks, all the artists and producers and everybody who's helped me on the tracks. Like, there's too many names to mention, but you know who you are. Um, I can't remember everyone, but if I missed you, I'm sorry, but I want to send a sh Oh, Sean, Black Oasis, definitely, Black Oasis, Sean, David, I have to definitely yeah. shout him out. He's coming um, up. Omari, Ian, 340 PM, so this, every, everybody, everybody, oh man, I'm, 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 I'm running out of names, but Brass Angel, I have someone behind the camera actually <laughs> giving me the name, so I was much appreciated. Big yeah, Drastic, Kevick, Jugger, Payback, Titan, Emmanuel, Maurice. Some people I can't name because I don't want to get it on the back. BB, I got Icewag on there. I got um, Shot Up from Out the Box. I got uh, too much names to mention, man. <laughs> the Video Girls, everybody, you know, I mean, who came through. Definitely Ricky. Man, just everybody. Just shout out to everyone. If I miss your name, it's not on purpose, man. There's just so much people that's been involved and been a part of the project. Thank you for coming through, you know what I mean? I want to send them a shout out, you know what I mean? You can see, folks, Project VI is deep. Definitely. Again, it's 340pm.com, don't forget to pin it to the world. Show. TBM. Watch it.